the rest of the people in, in the case of Uganda were in what they call subsistence economy. Kutumukia tumbo peke yake. You, you, you produce only for eating. Uh, no money. That's the structure we had. So on the one hand, you, you, you had a structural, a, a, a structural distortion of the society. Only, mainly peasants. Then a smaller portion of them in the money economy in the three three C's, three T's. The rest, just Uko Polini, they will be, they will see this need more clearly. Uh -huh. The business people, they will see it more clearly. And uh, even now, when we are talking about integration, you find that the Kenyans, because they are more business oriented, they get it quickly. They get it quickly, they see the importance. Because like, like people who, who united uh, United States, we are we are business people, people like George Washington. So the people who can help, apart from the the patriots, the ones who who, who see that if we unite, we are stronger and so on. The other people who can help us are the business people, yeah. the business people. They, 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 they can see this point more clearly than, uh, than, than anybody else. The, the struggle for value addition uh, is, a, is a very big one. If you take coffee, the value of coffee in the whole world, in the whole world, the value of coffee business is 460 billion dollars but all the coffee growing countries out of that 460 billion they share 25 billion <coughs> that's what they get so we will have an alternative but to struggle with with this company it is true because if you add coffee, if you add value to coffee in Uganda, instead of uh, getting uh, eight hundred million dollars like now from that coffee, we shall be getting about four billion. Uh -huh. But it, but the jobs also will be here. Because uh -huh. like if you take uh, like cotton. Cotton has got, I think, seven levels of jobs. You grow the cotton, that's a job. You 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 harvest the coffee, uh, cotton, and gin it. Those are some also jobs. So that's why we we, we now struggle with them. Uh, and there, there are a lot of confusion. Churches, wana kuja, wana semi mambo yao, then NGOs, uh, confusing them so that they don't even concentrate on our uh, message of of. Uh, so we, we eventually we have been struggling to say, look here, we we need a four acres model. If you have got four acres and less and we need to make a distinction between what we call intensive agriculture and extensive agriculture so this is the only team sir that is honored to meet uh, the head of state so we don't take that for granted and uh, on behalf of the co uh, co uh, commandant i want to say thank you sir and the, uh, the talk that you have given us the wisdom that you have shared with us uh, goes a long way in enhancing uh, the learning experience both at the college and outside in future.